Okay, this how-to video is going to talk about uh, min-max propagation delay inside AllCAD PCB Designer Professional. Um, I would need at least the AllCAD PCB Designer Professional or an Allegro PCB Designer license to be able to use this feature. And what this does is gives me the ability to set a specific uh, length between uh, a pin pair, as in two, a section of the net. Um, so in this example here, my, my signal integrity engineer has told me that I've got a far end termination this resistor network and I need to have it a specific distance away from this memory device. So how would I go about setting that kind of sort of rule? If I go to Constraint Manager uh, and we look in the electrical, routing, mass propagation delays, there's my, my four address nets effectively. So what I want to do is I need to create a specific pin pair. So I need to split up this, this net into a section of a net called a pin pair. So I can select the net, right click, create a pin pair. So I want to go from U10 to the resistor network and I click apply. Now I get a warning basically saying that I must make sure that when I create a pin pair that I give it a specific rule. If I don't, then it will just be removed and I'll have to recreate it again. So we'll just say okay to that. And you can see that the pin pair then gets created. So I'm gonna repeat that for the other four nets. So we'll create a pin pair from U10 to RN7, RN1. Create a pin pair from U10 to RN1 and we'll create a pin pair from U10 to RN1 and click OK. So then what I need to do is set the specific minimum and maximum propagation delay rules for this for these, these pin pairs. So I'm going to set a value of 400 and 500 for each of, the, of these nets to say I want to match them within 100 mils of one another. And you can see that the constraint manager is updating automatically to say I've got one that actually meets the minimum rule they all meet the maximum rule but they all need to come up by a set amount of distance so if we actually look at that on the PCB window you can see I'm getting a, a DRC error here if we hover over the DRC it's a propagation delay telling me the actual value so I probably need to add about 50 mils just under 50 mils to, to get this one to meet this one's about 20 mils this one's about what's well, about three mils so we can use the delay command we can go to the options menu, we'll just pin that out, and let's just add some accordion. You can see you're getting the real-time feedback bars, so we can just click on here and get the DRCs to meet, or the constraints to be met. Once that's done, if we go back to Constraint Manager, you can see that all the values are green and we're good to go.